Hello everyone, Jason Alea back here again, and today, welcome to another episode of Fuck You Warner Brothers. So a couple of days ago, Warner Brothers decided to release a 4K trailer of the Justice League film that came out in 2017, you know, the version of Justice League that everybody hated it. I liked the film at first, but over the years, ever since I got the 4K release, and I tried to watch it again, I never had any desire to. I didn't know why because I thought I enjoyed the film. And I started thinking about it and I enjoyed it a little less. But when I saw the film for the last time, the day before Zack Snyder's Just League film came out, with my mother who never seen the film and wanted to understand the differences before she saw the 4-hour version, um, I hated it. I absolutely hated the film now. I am embarrassed to have that 4K version, but I feel like it is necessary to to like keep it in storage so that I could show everybody how you don't make a certain type of movie. So in a way, I'm glad I kept it, but still, I do not recommend you guys go buy it. It's a really bad movie, and it's not even the director's vision. It is like an embarrassment, a total embarrassment that does not hold up very well. And Zack Snyder's Justice League came out a month ago, and everybody loves it. Even people who didn't love Zack Snyder films, not I'm not gonna say everybody, but most people that that did not like Zack Snyder's films actually enjoyed this film. And I actually have friends who did not really enjoy his movies much, actually come around to this version of Just League and say, hey, it's not that bad. So, clearly, this film had a fan base. It, it is successful on HBO Max. And I'm pretty sure Warner Brothers is not going to show the full numbers of this film because they're so embarrassed on how this is going to look on them and how they treated Zack Snyder before. And they've been doing... Everything they can to bury this guy. And it failed miserably. I am pretty sure the hashtag Restore Snyderverse on Twitter is up to like over 2 million hashtags now. Like it was trending number one with 1.5. Like it was a big hashtag. Everybody was like the Restore Snyderverse. And immediately I knew that Warner Brothers probably did not show the full numbers and it was extremely successful. But now they released a 4K trailer of Justice League 2017. This was insulting to fans, the director, and some of the actors came in like Ray Porter who portrayed Darkseid. They all said, this, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is wrong with you? This wasn't even an edited new trailer. This was just like a restore a restoration trailer of one of the previous ones from like 2017 marketing. You'll probably know the similarities, but man, Jesus fucking Christ. What the fuck be this what the fuck did they think that was gonna happen? Sure they want to insult the fans to show hey this is canon but you're better off ignoring because now you're just gonna feel the flame even more. You are just going to bring in more people to be like restore the Snyderverse. And your, and your like, uh, bosses, uh, the people who, who, like, give you the money to make the, these movies, they're going to be like, why the hell are you not doing this? Clearly everybody wants this. This is going to make money. And I can only assume that they just want to, go a new direction, which is exactly what they're doing. But the thing is, all the DC films in the DCEU are still going to be somewhat connected to Zack Snyder's version. Like, everybody, from what I heard from the Aquaman director, Patty Jenkins, even though maybe not clearly, they all said that their movies are going to be more in line with what Zack Snyder himself has done. Not the Justice League Zack Snyder version. So, obviously, there's going to be a bit of confusion. And people are going to be mad that this is a version that's going to be canon. And clearly there's another version that you could easily make canon and forget the other one because it was a failure. 
Uh, uh, this is pissing me off. This is really pissing me off. This 4K trailer was... The release was... Uh, it was just a horrible idea. You just feel the flames even more. And you just insulted the creators and people who worked hard on this film. And the fans who hashtagged uh, try to get this film made for the director who wanted this version out there. You just insulted us all. And the, the film is still fresh. It's not even a, it's a month since it came out now. And you're going to hit us with this shit? Really? Warner Brothers? Fuck you. I done a video saying fuck you to Warner Brothers a long time ago because they started uh, demonetizing my videos of their reactions. I have found a way around that, but now they come with this shit. This is episode 2 of Fuck You to Warner Brothers. Hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you guys next time.